Plants make up 80% of the food we eat and produce 98% of the oxygen we breathe. However, they are under constant and growing threat from pest damage that causes an annual loss of about 40% of food crops, with annual losses now amounting to more than $600 billion. The year 2020 was launched as the year of plant health on the sidelines of a meeting of the FAO Council, where he noted that plants are the fundamental basis of life on Earth and the single most important pillar of human nutrition, called for immediate action to produce a healthy plant, and indicated that much remains to be done to ensure plant health. Therefore, every country must work to have self-sufficiency in some strategic products and the development of agricultural wealth and livestock. One of the most important causes of loss in agricultural products is the spread of diseases and lack of good care. We have reached a solution, which is to develop an application that covers agricultural aspects of daily headlines news related to the environment, agriculture and food. Also, enabling each owner of agricultural land to monitor the quality of his agricultural products in terms of plants by taking a picture of the leaf of the plant that appears to be infected, and with a quick image processing, it identifies the type of disease affected by information about it, its causes, how to prevent it, and a method of treatment with the correct pesticides, and also provide a model that can classify the quality of milk using sensors that provide it with information such a s fat percentage, acidity percentage, and color. Through another model, it is possible to predict the kind damage that may affect a crop, given the cultivation season, pesticides used, and other information. With this, we are aiming to ensure farmland sustainability, carbon dioxide reduction and increasing agricultural products and improving their quality in the markets, thus increasing exports and providing hard currency. We can increase the environmental and agricultural awareness, reduce the consumption of unnecessary pesticides, reduce the import of pesticides, and increase farmer awareness. Even in agriculture, there are errors in choosing pesticides, and we try to reduce this because choosing wrong pesticides increases the rate of crop failure. We can use the drone to explore larger areas of farmland to be able to observe and communicate better with the cessnaros.